132 people just died today from suicide. They felt like their lives were pointless, meaningless, and they had nothing to live for. They felt like killing themselves was the only option, when in reality, they needed help and the resources weren't there. In America now, mental health resources are very hard to come by and hard to find. This results in 32 deaths every day. Childhood trauma and childhood experiences affect one in every five US citizens with mental illness, whether that be anxiety, depression, or childhood traumas. These are the only cases recorded in America. Millions of people around the world are scared to seek help and they feel vulnerable and that no one will understand truly what's going on. My name is Nathan Lopez. The study I did on psychiatrists were more beneficial to talk to than a therapist because they could break down your mind, your body, and build a trust with you so you could be vulnerable and tell them your true feelings. And they could diagnose you with the right medication to help you. People who seek the psychiatrist were less likely to commit suicide, although it is very hard to get in contact with a psychiatrist. But when you are, it could be life changing for a person. This results in a lot less deaths in America. The cost of a psychiatrist is very expensive, so limited amount of people are, have access to a psychiatrist. But when you are, it could be life changing for a person. This results in a lot less deaths in America. The cost of a psychiatrist is very expensive, so limited amount of people have access or the funds for a psychiatrist. 60 to 80% of adults who received help felt like it was beneficial and helped their state of mind. Although 56% of adults who don't receive help due to lack of resources and lack of costs, they have to deal with their feelings and emotions by themselves. Things you could do to help mental health and help suicide is check on your friends, make sure that you are looking at the signs and behaviors and what changes. Don't be scared to ask, are you okay? Don't be scared to make sure your loved one is fine because you never know what they are going through. Thank you so much for listening. I hope this encourages you to call loved ones more and friends. Everyone has a bad day every once in a while. You calling could just make their day better.